According to the World Meteorological Organization, the past decade on planet Earth was the hottest on record, and the last five years alone are the hottest stretch ever recorded. This is where the average minimum Arctic sea ice has been from 1981 to 2010, and this is where the Arctic sea ice was in September of 2019. As our ice caps melt, a lot of people think that our biggest concern should be sea level rise, but unfortunately, that's the least of our problems. Yes, sea level rise will affect billions of people who live in coastal cities around the world and trigger mass migrations, but sea level rise happens relatively slowly, and while catastrophic, we will at least see it coming and have some time to adapt. Here are some of the bigger issues that we'll have to deal with as the ice on Earth melts. Number one, drinking water shortage. Our drinking water comes mainly from rivers, lakes, and underground aquifers. That water usually comes from melting snow and glaciers that come down from mountainous areas. When the global temperature is too hot for glaciers to reform, those rivers and lakes dry up and people lose freshwater resources. We can already see this happening in India, where a city of 10 million people almost completely ran out of water in 2019. India gets a lot of its water from monsoon rains and the melting snow coming down from the Himalayan plateau. Climate change is making rain patterns unpredictable and reducing the amount of snow that assembles in the Himalayas. As a result, a government think tank predicted that around 40% of the Indian population, about 500 million people, will have no access to drinking water by 2030. Number two, melting ice can release new viruses. Unfortunately, we don't know what's trapped underneath the ice. A recent group of researchers who were studying old glaciers in Tibet uncovered 28 new viral groups that have been trapped in the ice for tens of thousands of years. The fear is that as glaciers around the world shrink, these types of unknown viral groups will get released into the world. This scenario already happened at a smaller scale in Siberia in 2016, when the melting permafrost uncovered an old deer carcass that had been infected with anthrax decades ago. This resulted in an anthrax outbreak that killed over 2,000 deer and sent 96 people to the hospital. Number three, ice caps melting means faster global warming. The ice caps on Earth are currently operating as gigantic shields that reflect the sun's heat away from our surface. As the ice melts and turns into water, two things happen. One, there's less of a shield to reflect away the sun's rays, and two, the new water actually ends up absorbing a lot more heat and creates more cloud cover, trapping the heat and making the earth warm at an even faster rate. We can clearly see this is already happening in the rate of increase in ocean temperatures over the last 80 years. So what can you do? The UN says we have about 10 years to drastically cut down our greenhouse gas emissions and avoid the worst consequences of man-made climate change. This will require mass mobilization away from fossil fuels, so it won't be easy. Renewable energy, water conservation, reforestation, and education to combat misinformation are all efforts to help protect the ecological balance that we desperately depend on. So take your pick and help save the humans. Peace.